We're given our expression for y there, and we need to differentiate it. So just looking at the way it's written at the moment, these two terms are going to differentiate pretty easily. However, we've got this bit of a fraction here that we need to rewrite first. So first thing, I'm going to rewrite this. Leave the first two fractions as they are. And I'm going to split this fraction into 2x cubed over 3 root x minus 7 over 3 root x. So I've just split this fraction into two separate fractions. Now, this root x, I can write that as x to the power of a half. Which means that I can now use some index laws to simplify this. Because the x cubed divided by the x to the power of a half. So 3 take away a half is 2 and a half or 5 over 2. And then this x to the power of a half on the denominator there. I'm going to move that to the numerator with a negative power. So that's going to be x to the power of minus one half. Right, now we're ready to differentiate. So the 3x squared will differentiate to be 6x. The 6x to the power of 1 third will differentiate to be 6 times a third is 2. 1 third take away 1 is minus 2 thirds. Then we've got the 2 thirds multiplied by the 5 over 2 which is going to give 5 over 3. And we'll take 1 away from the power. The 5 over 2, take away 1, is 3 over 2. Then we've got the minus 1 half times the minus 7 over 3. We'll give positive 7 over 6. Take 1 away from the power, minus a half, take away 1 is minus 3 over 2. And there we go. That is dy by dx in its simplified form.